I want to show you two really quick things about the Firefox DevTools that are little tiny icons that you might not notice, but you definitely want to know about. I'm here on a random web page, working on the CSS, working on the HTML. Right here, you'll see that there's this little icon that you can click that toggles the DevTools to switch from having two panels to having three panels. Now there's a good chance when you download Firefox and you open it for the first time, it will open with three panels. But in case it didn't, or in case you switch back to two and you didn't realize it, this is where the button is. You click this little button and it goes from having HTML and CSS to having HTML, CSS, and something else. And the something else's include our layout tools, a panel that gives you the computed values for everything in CSS, uh, the changes tab that, that lets you know when things have changed or keeps track of your changes for you, um, the font inspector, which gives you a way to adjust and change fonts around and mess around with variable fonts if you're using a variable font, and the animations inspector, which if you have animations on the page, is a place where you can see exactly what's going on with animations. These are powerful tools, and we may add some more in here someday. Um, I think it's really handy to be able to see the HTML in one pane, to see the CSS in another panel, and to see things about the CSS in the third panel. The other thing I wanted to make sure that you know about is this little button for messing around with print style sheets. So let's move this dev tool out a bit and you can see right here, there's a little icon that looks like a piece of paper and it makes the browser think that it's about to print a piece of paper, that it is printing a piece of paper. It will turn on any media queries that you have set for print. It will activate the kind of rendering engine behavior that gets activated whenever someone goes to actually print the page. So it's a quick way if you're styling print style sheets, which you know you should do to check that and not have to actually find a printer and print it out. You can see here on MDN, a person goes to the web page in a normal fashion. These buttons, like the edit button or all of this, this navigation in the sidebar, this is all here. But if you're printing it out, why print it out? None of these buttons will actually do anything on a piece of paper. That's like one of the things that you want to do when you have print style sheets is remove things that you don't necessarily need. So two little things about CSS DevTools in Firefox that uh, I thought you might want to know about.